Hello friends, today we will learn about the types of force. You are playing here in the park. Could you throw the ball straight up? See, it came back. The ball went up because you applied a force to it. And it came back because of the force applied by Earth. Force is a push or a pull of an object that causes the object to speed up, slow down, or stay in one place. You know, there are two types of forces, contact forces and non-contact forces. Let's learn about these one by one. Contact forces. Contact forces are forces in which two or more objects or bodies touch or contact each other directly. An example of contact force is sandpaper rubbing on a piece of wood. Here, the two objects touch each other. Let's see the types of contact forces. Frictional force. It is the force generated by two surfaces that contact and slide against each other. Here, the force is opposing the movement between you and the surface, which is sliding against each other. Normal force. Look at this cute cat! It experiences a normal force from the ground that balances its weight, allowing it to remain stationary. The normal force is defined as the force that a surface employs on any other body. The force exerted by a table on a book resting on it is also an example of normal force. Tension force. It is defined as the force transmitted through a rope, string, or wire when pulled by forces acting from opposite sides. Applied force. A boy pulling a suitcase on its wheels applies a force on the handle of the suitcase. When an object attracts or repels one or more other objects, it is said to be applying some force. Air resistance force. This is a type of force that acts in the opposite direction to an object moving through the air. Airplanes, helicopters, and birds are all examples of objects that regularly encounter air resistance. Spring force. You are playing with this spring toy. The spring is stretching and compressing, which results in a force that causes the movement. If the spring is stretched, spring force is attractive. If it is compressed, spring force is repulsive. You have seen the types of contact forces. Now, we will see the non-contact forces. See, a mango is falling from the tree. It is an example of a non-contact force. A non-contact force is a type of force that acts on the object without any physical contact with it. You have started eating this juicy mango. Let's see different types of non-contact forces. Gravitational force. When you were washing the mango, the water was coming downwards. It was due to the gravitational force which is the force of attraction between all masses in the universe. Electrical force. The repulsive or attractive interaction between any two charged bodies is called electrical force. For example, the charge in a bulb and electrical circuits. Magnetic force. A magnet is a rock or a piece of metal that can pull certain kinds of metal toward itself. The force of magnets is called magnetism. You have prepared a chart. Could you show it to your friends? Types of forces, contact and non-contact. You can use it for your assignments. Now, you know a lot about types of forces. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye-bye.